it's like anything else. One needs to keep repeating or reiterating a solid, focused feeling and thought about becoming what you want to become. If you don't do that, there's chances of you not happening. So what does it tell you? It tells you if you're on the case and you keep believing that I can, I am, and I will uh, have those thoughts and feelings in your body saying that I am going to create my life to be the way I want it to be. I can be one of the greatest singers that's ever come out of this country, ever, ever. And to feel that from your recordings, from the YouTube, and from the, 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 the beautiful charity work you've been doing. So you imagine, if that's what you're doing with that beautiful tones, and these people are really, really enjoying that, what is in you that says, I know I can do this, I know. And that's it. And once you keep doing that and keep doing that, and you're doing the work on your voice as well, you've got to do the practical work as well. Because life, energy, spirit works in both levels. It works with your amazing body that is given this life in a body, otherwise we couldn't talk. Mm -hmm. So it uses the body, so you've got to use the body yeah, yeah. To, to, to do the exercises, to do the work on that. But you've got to use your inner heart and soul that says, this is the thing that's singing, this is the thing that's presenting, this is the thing that's like Susan Boyle, this is the thing that's got something to say to this universe, and I'm ready to say it, I'm on the case to saying it. And that's it. And then there's no doubt in that. No doubt at all. And that's where we've got to go, where there's no doubt. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Now, if you could, if you could give me a pill now, yeah. or you could kind of inject that into me yeah. now, I'd be the happiest man in the world. Well, you see, the thing is, uh, you have the pill. I'm, all I'm doing is just being a mirror to you. It's like anything else. If you look at any human being, if you look closely to my eyes, look into my eyes, you'll start seeing a picture of yourself. Can you see it? Yeah. Can you see a picture of yourself I, in my eyes? Yeah, I can see it in your glasses firstly, yeah. but then I can see it in your eyes. Yeah, exactly. So why did life make it that you saw yourself in, your, in, in someone else? Okay. Because it's actually you are the most important thing. Life wants you to know you're the most important thing and you have got all the trust and love it takes to be who you are. My voice, my words, my truth is just mirroring that to you and saying, wake up to that truth. Wake up to the truth that you are extraordinary. If you don't do that, there's chances of you not happening. So what does it tell you? It tells you if you're on the case and you keep believing that I can, I am, and I will, uh, have those thoughts and feelings in your body saying that I am going to create my life to be the way I want it to be. I can be one of the greatest singers that's ever come out of this country. When, you, when, when you're at a point in your life where um, you're almost living on your dream, dreams don't pay the rent. And uh, uh, life is, is telling me, life is showing me, life is saying to me, you're going to have that confidence in yourself before you're going to get anything else. Right. So dreams don't pay the rent. That's correct. Nor does fear or doubt. True. Your dreams have more of a chance of paying the rent than fear and doubt does. Trust me. Trust me. Your dreams have more of a chance of creating your life to be the way you want it to be than fear and doubt does. The thing you want, the thing you want more than anything in your life, is to have that success, that joy, that fame, that beautiful opportunity to be financially secure, right? These are the things. And lots of people have these thoughts and feelings all over the world, every day. But do you know those that actually get it, eventually, stay with their dream. They actually stay with their dream. They don't have time to be in fear and doubt of that dream. They won't give themselves the time of day for that fear and doubt to take place. Now, yes, you've got to go home. You've got to be able to pay the rent. You've got to be able to say where your next pound is coming from, where your next thing is coming from, and so on and so forth. That I totally understand, because only three weeks ago I was in the same position. Exactly. Oh, what is it? And then I saw myself. I saw myself going down the path of fear and doubt. So I stopped it. I ain't going down the path of friend out. 
say that. I don't care. I'm not getting into that. I'm getting into what I know I am. What, who I know I am, and I'm getting to, to know what I can offer people, and what's what's value. What can I give people? What can I value? Can I offer this world in my talent, in my experience, and who I am? That's what I've got to concentrate on, not the lack. So when you concentrate on the lack, you'll get more of it. Mm -hmm. We've we subscribed to this idea of the law of attraction, have we not? Where whatever you concentrate on increases. Mm -hmm. So you concentrate on oh, but you know oh yeah, but. You see, all the air butts that come up in a person are doubts. As soon as you go, yeah, but, but these are doubts, and you're going to proceed a doubt. Every time it precedes a doubt. But, or is something going to come in there to interfere with it? And that's the problem. So get rid of all that, buts, no and if or buts. Feel the dream, know the dream, see the picture daily. Well, obviously, you have to deal with paying for this and paying for that when you can, in the circumstances you're in at the moment, still struggling through, that's going to happen until something comes in the door and something will come in the door. More chance of that than being in fear and doubt when you're in your dream. Be in your dream, you've got more of a chance of that happening than fear and doubt. At the moment, it's too, it's too what I call bright. So, ah! You're going up through your pharynx because you're afraid of the, uh, the chest uh, meeting it. You're going, ah! And it's too, hi there! We need it more, whoa, more vertical. Whoa! 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 Yeah, more relaxed. Whoa! 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 Much better. It's rounded. Did you hear that? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So just keep doing that. Whoa! 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 The key is this thing which goes whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not any effort. It should never be an effort, and it should be collecting the central sound beam in you. So it's got whoa. Whoa! Can you feel that? Whoa! Whoa! It's more real. Whoa! And it joins. Whoa! Whoa! Feel that warm? Yeah. You can feel how warm that was. Mm -hmm. That's the key. At the moment, we're here to make a pathway of relaxation with you attaining a particular note at a particular level with ease. What about? Intra introducing or, or the introduction of vibrato. Vibrato is important and, and, and it should only be used when the voice is perfectly attuned with all the voice production techniques it's got. Then you put the vibrato on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You can do it when you can do all those nice things. That's fine. But at the moment we're concentrating on trying to get the round rich tone with ease and elegance without you trying to force or push or do anything other than just letting the central sound beam do it. Because when the central sound beam does it, I'm very relaxed. I'm not forcing anything. Imagine you're a god, Zeus, the Greek god, and whoa! Whoa! If you tickled then, did you tickle? Mm -hmm. Right. Pushing. Right. I'm not pushing. I'm aiming. When you push, you tickle, you screw the voice. You tickle the vocal cords. Yes. Yeah. Right, and it tickles. Mm -hmm. And that's dangerous. You do that too many times, you get the notes. Whoa! Feel that? Mm -hmm. You feel how you can now, if you keep practicing that, you'll sustain the note as long as you like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There'll be no effort. Keep doing it until you really relax. Whoa! Yeah, you're still coming up into your trustworthy. Yeah! Tone. I don't want that tone. What we're doing, we're doing a healing process to a degree with the thoughts in you mm -hmm. and bringing you around to the body 
developing a pathway for you to get that note with more ease. Uh -huh. Because of the voice coaching, because of the vocal training and understanding of how this voice is working. Oh, when you got it in that position of relaxation. Hey, oh, 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 it's very nice, it's very easy. And then, and it just goes where it's a freedom and because the central sound beam's open. Hey, oh, it's just the thought of this song. Could I actually do it like Andre Bocelli? Mm. Better than Andre Bocelli? Yes, you bloody well could. And you can, and you will. And that's the state of mind you've got to get into. I'm going to. I will. I will create this. Whoa! I will get that note with ease. It's going to come to me. It will come to you when you do the work. And you get rid of the thoughts and the doubt and the fear that it's not. Same with the money. This is great, because it's running alongside you and your personal life. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Same with your personal life mm -hmm. and the money. It's All that will go into alignment with what you do when you and, and it's like I said to you the last session, the first session we had, that um, well, when you pointed out to me uh, how important your breath was, I uh, straight away recognised that breath was everything, and, and that everything was connected, basically. Yes. So uh, not just that the breath is connected to how you sing, how you speak, how you how you kind of what energy you have, but then that has a knock-on effect to your 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 personal life, your family life, your what you do for a living, how much money you make, how much money you don't make. Yeah. It's all connected. Because you're breathing throughout all those particular scenarios, otherwise you'd be dead, wouldn't you? Mm, mm, mm. So you're breathing in every scenario in your life. Mm -hmm. Every second you have 750 breaths every hour. So every second you're breathing. Mm -hmm. Here comes another one. Evan, right? yeah. why? Why did? To keep your mouth open. Yeah, but to keep an aperture and an open set of the throat so there's a wider sound. Oh, and you can feel you've got something to. This sort of tends to keep you focused on an openness. So stay with that. Put the mouth, fingers in. Oh. Lots of volume. Okay. Oh, 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 you're doing this. We need. Oh, 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 oh. So it's more of a thinner sound and it's relaxed. Oh, 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 oh. Better. Can you feel that? Mm -hmm. Now, that's negotiable. That voice is negotiable. The other one isn't. The other one's out there. Oh, oh, oh. It's gone, it's finished. Negotiable, you mean? Go up or you, you can go down. You can do what you like with oh. that. But when you've got the other one all the time, you can't put that oh, on it, can you? On it, yeah. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So you're keeping this negotiable all the time. So you've got a voice which is oh, which is a lovely sound. Oh, too loud. Oh, Top C sharp you break on. So that's because, um, again, you've not gone over this enough times. Mm -hmm. Now if you did the bubble here, try the bubble here. Okay, let's try this one. Keeping the dumb eyes, sending it down. So, and it will be connected. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Whereas you, you don't do the bubble, you won't get, it won't make a pathway for you as much. Mm -hmm. You need to get that pathway. That's why the bubble technique is very powerful for that. Okay. Very, one of the most powerful uh, techniques that have been brought into the scene in the last 30 years. Yeah, Stevie Wonder, everybody does it. Why? Because it just makes a facilitation of the voice with ease. And you'll find you'll get a note with ease. No. Ah. See, it showed, it showed you where you're at, uh -huh. didn't it? Okay. It showed you where you're at. It showed you that in the bubble you were falsetto. 
you were actually uh, doing head tone voice. You go. <laughs> now, if I did that, watch. <laughs> I would come out like that as well. But I don't. I do. <laughs> That's more like it, but you see the power and the force you're giving that. It doesn't need to be there. Watch. It's not need to Yeah. Keep, uh, what I want you to develop is this little voice inside you. Mm -hmm. The little man inside you going, oh, no, no, what I call it in. Oh, oh, it's in there. Now get the A. Right, you hear that tone? A. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. bouncing in your head but it's in the mouth mm -hmm. it's not here there's no tension in the throat whatsoever mm -hmm. when you're doing that nope. can you feel that yeah this is, so this is where when you marry that whoa 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 feel that yeah you know go whoa feel that uh -huh. now you're not that way you're more like that aren't you mm -hmm. okay, whoa what have you understood about what you've done in terms of the techniques? You mean this, this, yeah, this these session? This session and this technique bring you into that place. I mean, the, 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 the huge one is pushing, pushing, yeah. forcing. Um, and, and, and like I said earlier, and, and not, not just in a singing or a breathing uh, way, but in your I'm life. Finding that I'm finding I'm doing that in life. Yeah, yeah exactly. 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 And that's what is not serving you in your singing. Mm -hmm. So you're taking your life into your singing. And you take your singing into your life, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Which is all pushing. Mm -hmm. So learn. Don't push in your singing, and you won't push in your life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when mm -hmm. you won't push in your life, you won't push in your singing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they'll help, but they go hand in hand. Mm -hmm. That is it. That's here at Linda for the lesson on that fact. And there will be a harmonious movement that will start to take you over. I'm going to walk out that door and not look at life in the same way now. Feeling a lot more confident, feeling better with my... Uh, with my voice and just feeling better. Allow the singing to happen. Allow your life to unfold. That's it. That's the lesson. Thank you so much. Great. It's been Thank a great you. pleasure.